this is MK Fan 49 with another review. Today we'll be reviewing the Gargoyle, the NECA Gargoyles, Goliath and Demona, Val's Ultimate Action Figure 2 Pack. Here's the box opened up, as you can see. All the accessories of Goliath and Demona. When it's closed up. Uh, here's the back shot, and you see all the various poles you can get them in, and all the other cargo that's in the line. Here is the side picture of Demona, and here is the other side of Goliath. The top and the bottom, and let's crack them open. So we're gonna start off with the new Demona. I have, I am impressed to finally have. Some folded down wings instead of the traditional wings that goes up because I've always had bad wings. So with the new one, she can rotate the head 360, can look up that far, down that far, side to side. Um, Due to how the wings are on, you are limited unless you take these off. So I would say you can go up this far and go that she does have a double arm bend which is nice she does have a bicep rotation hands can move 360 um you can she can do the splits she can kick only up that far. She does have a double knee bend, which is nice. She can move her foot, can go back that far. And she can also close. And she does have a little bit of toe articulation for the front, which is nice. Her tail is wired so you can get it in different poses, which is nice. She does come with a lot of alternate face plates. This is his, her, her, I guess, happy face when she was still happy with Goliath. You can remove this face plate and give her the snarling one when she was angry at the humans. like that when she was angry at the humans for messing with the castle and then you get an even more angrier face than that one so you get this one next it's even more angrier face and she has one more face plate she comes with this smiling face plate let me put this on next. This smiling face sculpt, which is nice. She does come with a lot of accessories for her hands. This is her one of her gripping hands she uses when she's trying to hold on to the her, the amulet before it breaks. This is actually from the episode of Vows. So let me remove these hands right here. And so this is one of her weapon holding hands. Once you get the, you know, it's a little tricky to get this in here. So she does come with a different weapon than the than the, than the regular release. She can hold that. She also does come with. A fisted hand for two of them and she does come with two open hands like this two weapon holding hands which is nice and the amulet And then you get one to where the amulet has already been broken, and they're trying to put it back together. 
it doesn't stay together, actually. I wish it would, but this is not how it was designed. Like that. And now let's get on to Goliath before we get on to comparisons. Here is the new Goliath. Now you do need to put that one of the two pieces on for the to order for the wings to stay on. I do like this head sculpt the most for it right now. Um, Goliath does come with an alternate faceplate, so if you don't want to have his smiling face. And due to the wings, you, you do you do lose um, a lot of so I get, um, different rotation. I got to get this on here. So you don't really get any movement because of how the wings are, unfortunately. Um, let me, I really don't want to take this off, but I have to take this off temporarily so I can show off articulation. So you can move the head almost 360, almost. Arms can move 360 without the wings. Can go out that far. You get a bicep rotation. Can do a double arm bend. Rotate for the fist. In and out. Upper waist, upper chest rotation. Can do the splits. Kick forward that far. Double knee bend. Feet can go back that far. Can go back that far for the legs. For the feet. At <coughs> <coughs> the tail is wired. Just like that. And he does say come with a lot of different face plates. That's his snarling face. His kind of like his smirking face next. For that one. And you got this face right here. So if you don't, I'm definitely going to be using this one the most for this head sculpt. Now you does come in a more relaxed fit. So if you want to use this one right here, you can actually choose the face plate you want to put for this one right here. But I'm not going to really use the relaxed fit. Let me get these back in place. To me, this is the best head sculpt to use is this one right here. And I'm going to put on, back on the smiling head sculpts. Um, these are his weapon, one of his weapon holding hands, which I have in right now. He can hold me. Okay. Maybe I got the wrong side. I got the wrong one in. Hold on. That's the hold something else. Let me get this one in. This one is to hold the mace like that. He does have an open palm hand. For like that. You get two fisted hands. And now we're gonna let's now go for comparisons. Here is the new Demona and Goliath. Here they are next to the first release of Demona. Mine has, like I said, had bad wings. I don't really put the tail 
on my my original Damana. The original release of Goliath. With the fold down wings. And last but not least, their daughter. Angela. I don't know, this doesn't. And I say, if I can get the, all right, and this is Angela, their daughter. Yeah, she doesn't want to stand right now. Now, overall, I do love this two-pack. I love the new shading on both ghosts, especially Goliath. He looks much better than how he looked in the first pack. I do like the wings better on the new one, and I love this new texture for the head. And it's great to have these two added to the collection with the proper wings. And if you did miss out on the first release of him, this is worth picking up. Same, definitely pick this up mainly for Demona. But I'm glad I picked it for him too. So please like the video. Please comment the video. Please share the video. Subscribe to the channel if you like the content that I'm providing. And click the notification bell to be notified when I upload any new videos or shorts. For any shorts and videos you may have missed. This is MKFan49 signing out. And this is a Best Buy exclusive.